Welcome to Beaufort, South Carolina. I'm Jennifer, and in this video, I'll be showing you Beaufort in the springtime. Beaufort is the second oldest town in South Carolina, and even though it looks like Beaufort, it's actually pronounced Beaufort. The Paris Church of St. Helena was so pretty. There are many historic churches in Beaufort, and I love the character of these treasured buildings. Robert Smalls was born into slavery in Beaufort in 1839. In 1862, he drove a Confederate supply ship into Union territory, escaping slavery. After the war, he returned to Buford and became a politician, started a school for African American children, started a newspaper and a general store. He is buried here at the Tabernacle Baptist Church. What an extraordinary life. It's such a warm day here in Beaufort. Let's head over to Southern Sweets on Bay Street for some ice cream. I love that it looks like an old fashioned ice cream parlor. The Spice and Tea Exchange is also located on Bay Street and Maggie loved checking out the herbal teas. have all the places that we visited today linked in the description box below. Beaufort was named the South's Best Small Town by Southern Living Magazine for 2022. I just love to stroll around Buford looking at these grand old southern homes and majestic live oaks. Do you enjoy doing the same kinds of things? Let me know in the comments below. in the low country for three of my high school years and a lot of people that I knew back then preferred the ritziness of Hilton Head Island but I've always loved Beaufort it has a special place in my heart
pleasant stroll through the waterfront park and enjoy the ocean breezes and the beautiful views. Hey friends, thanks for stopping by to watch another of my videos. If you're enjoying this video, would you please give it a thumbs up? And if you know someone who's interested in Beaufort, would you please share this video with them? It helps me out more than you know. this charming little park with a gorgeous view of the marsh and we realized that the bridge was opening to let a boat pass through. This mud is known as pluff mud and it's part of the salt marsh. It also has a very unique smell. I got so tickled when I saw this little boat. I'm used to seeing the big boats in Savannah that pass by River Street. If you're interested in learning more about River Street, I have a video all about it and I'll link it in the description box below. We saw a real live Hudson Hornet. We were so excited as we've never seen one in real life before. If you've seen the movie Cars, then you'll know that Doc was the fabulous Hudson Hornet. The University of South Carolina has a cute little campus in Beaufort. <music> 